Pisces, what's up Pisces? Welcome back. Thank you guys for watching my channel. She's got the gift. Pisces, when I was meditating on your energy, I just heard if you can't handle, you can't handle the truth. Don't ask for it. So I don't know, but I'm back with messages for you. Please take what resonates from these messages. First and foremost, always follow your discernment. Listen to yourself first, okay? Um, take what's for you from the tarot readers and leave the rest right on where it's at. If you're seeking a personal from me at this time, feel free to stop by and check out my website. You can book your personal reading there. And also, if you want to see more content, you're always welcome over there on my Patreon and um, TikTok. Also, members only, you got to love reading. If you're interested in love, Pisces, check the members only out, okay? Let's jump into your messages. Spirit, holy angels, I call upon you for the sign of Pisces. Allow me insight, please, and thank you. Please continue to protect us. Thank you for protecting us and our families. Allow no weapon that's being formed to come against us to ever prosper. All black magic, evil entity, and spirit work is to be returned back to sender and do not allow it to affect us. Thank you. Messages for Pisces, spirit angels. Messages for Pisces. You can't handle the truth. Don't ask for it, huh? Maybe somebody questioning you, Pisces. You got a ring. A marriage will take place either romance, romantic or business. Okay, we'll see more about that. The month of November is very significant. Now, this could have something to do with November 2023. So, when we get down and break it down, we'll figure it out, okay? And then you said, it says older male. Dealing out with a relationship with the older male. Give me one more. Rose, romance is in the air at the bottom of the deck. Affairs with family. Mm -hmm. You got ring out here, romance, all right. Love is in the air. Go watch the love reading. A marriage will take place either romantic or business. Show me more about this. A marriage will take place. Eight of swords, three of swords, damn. The higher fine here, nine of cups. Somebody did this for their own selfish gain, though. Yeah. Oh, we something is stressful, Pisces. I just feel that energy. I don't know if somebody doing this to get back at somebody else. You got the eight of swords here, the three of swords, the higher fine with the nine of cups. This is someone's wish, though, to be married. Yeah, this is definitely in the romance department. It ain't business. But I feel like it's for some... It, I, I just don't feel like it's genuine. One on the, eight of, on the Eight of Swords. A couple of you guys could be dealing with an air sign. Gemini in particular. Inside on this Eight of Swords. Something, something ain't genuine, Pisces. Justice. Marriage. I mean, jail. Page of Wands here. Two of Wands with Justice. One more. King of Swords, yeah. I don't know, Pisces. I feel like somebody is doing this to keep you, like, tied to them, but they got something going on. They have another option here, and this option could be saying something here. About what? One, one, on, a king, one on a page of wands. The lovers here, Gemini energy is here strong. The lovers and the king of cups. Damn. Damn. Somebody here could be bisexual, Pisces. Be careful. You're dealing with somebody who's bisexual, babe. Who is this? Th Why is this Three of Swords energy here? Page of Wands was clarified with the lovers and the king of cups. It doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be the same. And he he interested in the same sex. It could just be somebody that he has feelings for. Page of Wands is clarified with the lovers here in the King of Cups. It's definitely another masculine, though. Like something to do with another masculine and being this person's lover. Or right, this is you, Pisces. You got two people to choose from. One that you're in love with. One that you're just dealing with here because you got the Two of Wands. Inside on the Two of Wands, it's like somebody has a decision to make. They got two men out here. 
Okay, one is one they're emotionally invested in, the other one they serious with, but they doing this to do what? The two of wands is clarified with the seven of swords. Exactly. That vindictive energy is coming out here. I felt it. It's like somebody doing something to get back at another person or make to, to make another person feel some sort of way here. Okay. Inside on November. Yeah, somebody doing this only to get back at you, Pisces, or you doing this only to get back at somebody else. Uh, Queen of Pentacles here showing up, Nine of Pentacles, some sort of money, a breakthrough with your finances here. Increase in finances in November is happening. But this is going to be given to you by a person here. Someone new is interested in you. This person could be from, this person here already has, like, they're self-made. Mm, yeah, this could be a Taurus. This could be a Virgo here or a Capricorn. That presents this apology and mm -hmm. <sighs> delusional illusions. This person, boy, boy, boy. All right, this could be you. Page of Cups here with the Seven of Cups. It's like soon as somebody see you with somebody else, or soon as you see somebody with somebody else, that's when they want to come in and love bomb you. I don't know. They ran off with another person and got married or something like that. But just to get up under your skin when you really is in love with this person, or this person really is in love with you, but they dealing with somebody else over here. It's not nothing serious, though, okay? I was asked, what was the two of wands for? They, it clarified with the seven of swords. So people, somebody here is just dealing with two people or dealing with these two people on and off to get up under someone else's skin. The person that they really in love with. And then you got over here in November, like all the shit is going to hit the fan about who this person is really sleeping with. And like all of these illusions and options coming out about this person here. It's like this female. You got two men, two men over here and then you got this female. Oh, Lord have mercy. Mm. That's, that's sexually active with these people be careful somebody might not know who the kid dad is you have the seven page of cups clarifying with the seven of cups here the nine of pentacles with the queen of pentacles another like person that you're gonna have to take care of it's like something is mm -hmm. Ace of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Just be careful and strap up, okay? What's up with this older male here? One of them could be older. You got the King of Cups here, King of Swords. One of them could be older. One of them could be younger. Insight on this, dealing with it, dealing in our relationships with this male. This person is lying. This person is broke as a motherfucker. They sick and they got sick. Whoever this older male is, Pisces, I don't know whoever the older one is, okay? He's sick. He taking pills behind your back. He broke. He don't got nowhere to go. Just pay attention. Don't be fucking on nobody here. Oh, Lord. It just seemed like this female is like going to get caught up. She the one setting traps for these men, but at the end of the day, the female going to end up getting caught up. She going to end up being pregnant, don't know who the kid dad is, okay? You got the older male here that you fucking with or whoever this is that's dealing with. He's sick and don't want to tell you this, and he also broke. Mmm. Somebody is just doing something for attention. What's romances in the air, Pisces? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Whatever you got going on or whoever this, these men, whatever they got going on. I just feel like somebody feel like they playing people, but at the end, they going to be played. The Empress, I told you the pregnancy. Romances in the air, all that fucking and legs in the air. There's a baby coming. Yeah. The Empress here, King of Wands here, and the Queen of Cups. Pregnancy. Somebody at the end, the end somebody gonna end up pregnant and not knowing who the it was the outcome. What's the outcome? Damn. Somebody dealing with a Gemini, Taurus Virgo. Gemini is out here. Taurus Virgo, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. Cancer energy is here. Pisces energy. Your your energy is here. And three of swords. At the end of it all, heartbroken. Outcome for Pisces. The Knight of Cups here. Be careful for what you ask for. Knight of Cups, Nine of Swords, and the Two of Pentacles for your outcome. Advice. 
Mm, 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 mm. Keep your eyes on the prize and let go of shit that does not serve your purpose. Like, I don't know what you got going on here, Pisces. You got me scratching my head and shit. Look, you got the Queen of Swords here at the bottom of the deck. I told you there's a couple here that's going at it. There's a couple that's going at it. Somebody trying to one-up the couple. They get pregnant by somebody. They don't know if they're, they're, they're their person or this other person over here. Look, you got a King of Wands out here, a King of Cups, and a King of Swords. Somebody is big fucking out here, okay? And the outcome, you're going to be stressed out and left behind. Knight of Cups energy here. The outcome of somebody, not you, Pisces, somebody is going to be stressed out, left behind here, and having to deal with shit on their own, having to take care of shit on their own, period. Your advice here is to let shit go because it's about to get harder for you. It's about to get hard for somebody. Your advice is to let it go if it don't serve your purpose and do what's best for you, okay? At the end of the day, somebody... Mm -hmm. Baby, this is a mess. This is a messy reading right here, and I don't want no parts of it. Love you, Pisces. I'm gone. I hope this helped you, babe. Don't forget to hit the like, the comment, and subscribe button. Peace.